Yo, what is going up, my dudes? Luigi Elite here with another video regarding Mario-related stuff. As you might know, October has already had some pretty big things regarding gaming. Super Mario Bros. 35 was released, which has been pretty fun to play. We got more information on Mario Kart Live Home Circuit, and of course, Steve is in Smash. It's beautiful. But the main thing that the month of October is known for is Halloween, and this is also the year where YouTubers can get all of their spooks out for the internet to enjoy. So I decided I'm going to try some of that myself. And what better way to start off this month than with one of Nintendo's spookiest franchises ever, Luigi's Mansion. The Luigi's Mansion games is one of my favorite franchises in gaming, and with three games in this series, I just love equipping my poltergust and hunting down ghosts just for the fun of it. In Scarescraper mode of Luigi's Mansion 3, which actually released on Halloween last year, you can quadruple the fun with four Luigi's and do even more ghost bus <coughs> I mean ghost hunting. Nintendo also released some DLC for this game where you can change your outfit in this mode to equip some cooler costumes, and using these costumes can also change the themes of the floors that you catched ghosts in. And since wearing costumes is such a big part of Halloween, today I'm going to be ranking all of Luigi's appearances from Luigi's Mansion 3. So with all that said, time to pick out your favorite trick-or-treating outfit. At number 7 is Mummiji. Now as cool as it might look to see Luigi all mummified, I never really liked this costume. It isn't as colorful as the other costumes, and the costume itself looks very bland and uninteresting, even though it definitely fits the Egyptian theme very well. Maybe if there were some rips in his clothing to show his regular clothes or something else to add more detail to his costume, then it probably would have been higher on the list. But overall, this outfit doesn't really fit with Luigi and could have looked a lot better. And next we have the Green Knight. Now unlike Momiji, I actually think this costume isn't half bad. The whole knight theme and armor looks pretty cool, and I like how Nintendo added a green shirt light thing on his chest. However, the reason it is lower on the list is because even though I like the knight theme, I don't think it looks the greatest on Luigi, and even though there is more color than Mamichi, there isn't enough color. Also, this is just a nitpicky thing, but the Poltergust G00 doesn't go with the costume. So again, the Green Knight isn't a bad costume, I just wish it was more Luigi-like. Next up, we of course have the Ordinary Overalls, Luigi's all too familiar apparel, even though this costume is the same old outfit he always wears during his adventures, the outfit still looks really good, and it looks even better today with updated graphics. I do feel bad for putting it lower on the list because, again, I still really like this costume. It just doesn't look as cool as the other costumes in the game. After that, we have the Palian 2 Luigiist. I never thought in a million years that Luigi would summon the courage to research dinosaurs. I think the costume looks really good both in general and on Luigi. He kind of looks like a green version of Jack Black from Jumanji. I mean seriously, if you put them side to side, they look very similar. All jokes aside, I do really like this outfit, and it really does make Luigi look like a paleontologist looking for fossils. Although, and this doesn't bother me, the hat does look pretty big for the costume. But if you want to talk about big hats, just wait until we get to the next costume on this list, the Amazing Luigi. And yes, Luigi does look amazing in this outfit. First of all, like I said, I do love his big ass hat with a little wand sticking out on top. The rest of the outfit looks nice too, with a little cute bow tie and the fancy shirt and pants to go with it. Luigi certainly does look like he's about to pull off some magic tricks as a magi magician, whatever they might be, and the costume overall looks great.
I'm sure some of you were expecting this outfit to be near the top, and that is Groovigi. Luigi looks absolutely hilarious in this costume. The sick green jacket and shirt that shows off Luigi's hairless chest, his pants and white shoes that surprisingly work with the outfit, and of course, his giant stylish hair. I mean, look at that. How did Luigi have time to grow all that out? Anyway, the reason why it is so high on the list is because I love how ridiculous it looks, and I love how much this costume fits with Luigi's wacky personality. However, there is one outfit that I love even more than this. And that is the one and only Captain Luigi. While what Luigi is the captain of remains a mystery, I absolutely love this costume. The rundown and faded pirate attire, his specially designed gloves and boots that makes him look more pirate-like, and my favorite part of the outfit, which is his trusty captain hat and scurvy eye patch to complete the look. Luigi looks awesome in this outfit, and it kind of makes me wish that we could have a Mario game that was completely pirate-based. And that would be a lot of fun. And that is why Captain Luigi is my favorite costume in Luigi's Mansion 3. So that's it for another Halloween video. If you enjoyed it, please hit the like button. And also let me know down in the comments what your favorite costume is from Luigi's Mansion 3. Also, hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications so you'll know whenever I post more awesome content like this. Have a great day. Stay safe out there. And I'll see you in the next one.